What's going on? Should I drink this? It's your man Insomniac. I figured I'd take a minute to tell you guys about a new coffee subscription kind of monthly club thing, which I'm actually drinking right now. It's called Amora Coffee. Before we get into the packages, a brief overview. Amora Coffee was founded in 2011. They're new on my radar, but they've been around for almost a decade. They sell coffee and tea, although we're not talking about the tea side. This is a coffee channel. We don't believe in tea here. And when I say we, I guess I mean me and my alternate personality, because I'm the only person here. Anyway coffee only, but I figured I'd mention that they also sell tea. They roast their own coffee here in the USA, and as of the time of this video, they have four blends available, but in multiple configurations. So they have four blends, but you can get those blends in either regular or decaf, and you could get them either natural, regular, just coffee, which is the way I drink it, or you could get them in four different flavors. Flavored coffee is something that we also don't believe in here, should I drink this? But either way, they have those options if you want them. All of those coffees are also available ordered as ground coffee or whole bean, and you can buy their individual bags of coffee, their individual blends from their website for $14.99 a bag, I believe, without signing up for the subscription. So if you wanna check out Amora Coffee, but you're not sure if you wanna sign up for any type of monthly thing or commit to basically any amount of money. You could just go to amoracoffee.com. I believe that's it. Let me double check. Yep, amoracoffee.com. And I'm sure I'll have a link in the video description and you can buy the bags individually if you want. So here I have one of the two boxes that I received from them already and the local post office or whoever to ship this kind of stuck a label over part of this which pisses me off because I wanted to show you the presentation. It's one of the things that I like about their monthly boxes. Not only do they look good, but they're well presented and well packed. The stuff inside is packed tight. Any extras that you get are in a good amount of bubble wrap. You can see here even the inside of the box isn't plain. Very nice presentation, I like that. And obviously one of the bags of coffee is missing. That's this one here, it's the one I'm already drinking. This is the Elegante blend, whole bean of course. But yeah, this is the standard type package which we'll get into in a little bit. You see there's four bags of coffee, the one I just showed you plus three more here in the box and an extra. Plus there's another extra here. We will also get to that in a minute. But as I said, nice packaging, nice bags as well. Now, like I always say, to me, what's important is the coffee. Is the coffee good? I don't care if it's a plain bag with a label slapped on it, if the coffee's great. But it is nice to see some attention to detail. I'm gonna give you a close up here of this bag. See that? Nice, kind of ornate, yet all of the bags have a similar aesthetic to them. I'm not gonna spend a ton of time on this because like I just said, that's not the important part of any coffee, but I do like the attention to detail, and if you're going to sign up for a monthly service or some type of regular coffee club, it is nice to see that they care about their packaging. And as I said a second ago, you do get extras with your package, but before I talk about the extras, let me talk about something that's fairly complicated and vague on their website, but it's at the same time pretty cool if you're looking for customization. The rep from Amora claims that you can have whatever bags of coffee you want in whatever configuration you want, so ground or whole bean regular or decaf, flavored or not flavored, in whatever quantity you want, and however often you want. So I keep referring to a monthly package, but it's not like if you go to the site, it says, here's the monthly package, here's what it costs, and here's option B or C if you want it. Apparently, you don't just have to get one package per month, and even if you do, you can, I guess, switch up which coffee you want in it, how much coffee you want in it. So I guess you can get multiple packages a month with as much or as little coffee as you want. Again, it's kind of vague. I went through the site. I talked to the rep about it. You're not going to get like a menu of here are your options for the subscription service and here's all the prices picked from these things. But again, if you're looking for maximum customization, then it's pretty cool. Personally, I'd like clear package options on the site, but I'm a person who's about efficiency, so that's me personally. But anyway, back to the free add-ons. If you have the subscription service, you do get some cool free stuff like this really heavy duty polished scoop. It's a really nice coffee scoop and it says Amora on it there as you can see. So that's one little extra that you get. They send you these Amora travel mugs, a free bag of coffee, a really nice airtight container, and even a coffee maker, which looks like a pretty nice coffee maker on the site. I'm assuming you have to be a member a little while in order to get that free, but 
Those are all things that are add-ons to the package if you're a member. So you might be thinking, well, give us some kind of reference point here because you said that there's basically ultimate customization options and packages to choose from based on whatever your desires are, but what kind of money are we talking about here? So we'll use my package as an example. I'm pointing down there because this table's small. I needed somewhere to put my coffee. So now my package is on the floor. But anyway, we'll use my package as an example, which to me would be like a standard monthly package if you drink the amount of coffee that I do. And that's four bags of coffee plus whatever extra that they send you every month. That's $68.75. So four bags of coffee, any coffee that you want, however you want it, and a free gift each month, $68.75. It's not so bad, especially for coffee that's roasted here. And when I say here, I mean in the States. Good attention to detail and uh, some really cool extras, like I said. And most importantly, if you're thinking, well, what if I don't like the coffee? Or what if I want to change something? Or what if I just decide I don't want to do this at all? Maybe I don't want to spend almost $70 a month if you were to get a, get a similar package to what I have here. Well, apparently, you can pause or cancel your subscription whenever you want. So it's not like you sign up and now they're going to charge your credit card or something for the next year and too bad. According to the website, you can walk away if you want whenever you want. And at the same time, if you don't like any of the coffees that they send you, you can exchange them or get a refund for up to 30 days. So I do like the fact that they give you that freedom so you don't feel like, all right, I'm taking a blind shot in the dark with this club and if I don't like the stuff too bad. You're not screwed with the stuff that you get if you don't like it or if you decide you don't want it anymore. So between the quality and customizability, that's definitely not a word, but you know, we're just gonna roll with it. In addition to their no hassle cancel and return policies, I'd say it's definitely worth looking into if you're a coffee lover. If you want to take a look at Amora's coffee subscription service, I have the direct link to the subscription service down in the video description. I know I'm pointing at the cup here. Let's try it now. Down in the video description, that's a little better. Check it out there. Uh, I don't get anything if you sign up, so this isn't one of those sponsored videos where I want everybody to make sure that they go get their Amora coffee so I can get rich. I'm just letting you know what I got so far. You can take that information and do what you want with it. If you're already a member with Amora Coffee, definitely leave comments down below. Let everybody know what kind of stuff you're getting and whether or not you're enjoying the club so far. If you think it's a good value, honest feedback helps people make informed purchase decisions. So that's always a good thing. Leave those comments down below. Anyway, thought I'd share this with you. The Amora Coffee Club, pretty interesting stuff. I'll see you all at the next one.